Hi guys! <laughs> Hi guys! We're cycling through the town or village of Garia, which is like the third village in a row from the Nile, you know, when you when you take the ferry from Luxor to the West Bank. This is number three. And actually, I know this is where you go when you, if you want to go to the Valley of Kings. Valley of the Kings, and there's also a Valley of the Queen, I think, Queens. And, but also, you know, you see these rocks over there, I mean, these, you know, hills, mountains. Oh, and actually here, we're passing tomatoes. Tomato, are these tomatoes? Tomato fields. If they are tomato fields, they're <laughs> red. Uh, you know. Anyway, so we just want to pass it and go over there. I think there's also some some freestanding statues, you know, that you don't have to pay, you know. I mean, if I go into the, you know, Valley of the Kings with my son here, who is back here, uh, yeah, he'll be like bored after 10 minutes. So let's check out some free stuff, you know, that we can both appreciate for a short while. And we both appreciate the agriculture here, you know, countryside, so is good. This village here, or this, you know, again, it's not really a village, right? This is like a road, and then there, are, at some point, there are lots more houses, and then that's a town or a village, you know. But it's not like it's hardly ever more than one road or one street, and then, you know, maybe a couple of small alleyways. But anyway, let's go over there to that, to those. St <laughs> there are lots of these papyrus institutes, but I'm not sure if they're actually institutes or if they're just. You know, producing them and selling them to tourists. Ah, yeah. Ah, how nice. The fields, they always, almost look like rice fields. But check out the hills in the back. See, that's over there, you see? That's the, the Valley of the Kings, you know. Probably would be interesting to actually go check it out. But not with my kids. <laughs> so check it out. This is the Memnus area which is actually free come sir hey you gonna come with me come on dude they close at five which is like in five minutes but see there's some free stuff and they're also they're happy people hello hello see lots of happy people around here but anyway so I wanted to lock my, my bicycle and the cop said, yeah, no, ne not necessary, I'm here. Yeah, if you see a cop riding my bicycle, then I shouldn't have trusted him. No, no, they're okay. I said, Vincent, Vincent, what do you think about these guys, huh? So they have, they, they look like, you know, they're all also have, you know, their faces are like destroyed. It's like the Romans, I think, destroyed like lots of shit here. Because I thought it's not worth it. Anyway. Yeah, I could walk further and further and look at all of these statues, but that's not what I do, right? And anyway, they're closing. The guy said, yeah, you go ahead. But it's cool, huh? They, yeah, they look a little bit like things, sinks. I mean, their heads. The sinks basically has, it's just like a human head, right? And, and, uh, and the body of a lion. So they have human uh, bodies. And check it out, it's cool, actually. I did not know that there'll be you know, free stuff, you know. There's even hieroglyphs on it. And I see that. Maybe some, some of you can translate that, that upper section. That's pretty cool. See, but he's bored already, so. Imagine me and my wife with these two kids, you know, paying entry, it's not cheap, by the way, to the Valley of the Kings. And, and then they, after five minutes, <laughs> they did, then, you know, let us know how boring it is. Anyway, so yeah, well, I'm not going to go further and I'd have to go through here and I don't have time. So there's some more statues. But anyway, you go check it out when you're here, right? Because you're much more interested in this there, in the farming life. And these date, yeah, they're, they're actually palm, uh, they're actually date palms. I wasn't sure, you know, remember the other videos? Now I know. Now I've learned. <laughs> I was just wondering because I didn't see any dates. It's because it's like in September. Hey, are we gonna go? Should, should, well, let's go continue. You, you wanna, you wanna further? Hey, let's go. 
You're always happy to leave, right? Yes. If this was a playground, things were different. Or if this was a, you know, like, whatever, uh, a beach or, I don't know, a forest or a paddy field, he'd be staying. But ancient monuments, you know, 5,000 year old ancient monuments, you know, uh, the witness, witnesses of ancient civilizations, no. He'll be bored after one minute. And he's more interested in cats as well. But, huh? This is beautiful, actually. See the desert there, the mountains, and the fields. See the farmers there, and the farmer kids. It's beautiful. Okay, Vincent, let's go. Let's hit the road. Back on a bicycle. Some more, it's actually pretty cool. These Colossus of Memnus, you know? And check out, see here, it's only, only one of the arms have been have been kept, have not been destroyed. And the other dude, you know, a lot more. Yeah, can't go on it, on, on that, I could go down there. But it's all right, let's just look at it, look at it a little bit, it's pretty cool actually. Hello. See, it's explanations, you can go through here. And let's go a bit further. See, lots of, lots of stuff. Hey, there is some free stuff here in Luxor. Who would have thought that? But of course, the cool stuff costs, which is all right. Of course, I'm not saying, I'm not saying don't go. It's just like for us going there to these. Nah, the, our, our our children would terrorize us. Our our children would tell us, "You're fucked up. This is boring." You know? <laughs> most most kids probably are bored. I mean, I'm, yeah, I, I would have been bored probably. Uh, at that age, not sure. Yeah, let's continue. Uh, so here's the, the backside. See some statues, still intact, and some, you know, this is just like, I don't know how much is that. Twenty percent of that body from this is the, from the back. Huh? It's cool. I mean, I could just climb over here and go down, but yeah. Cool as it is. What I like most is those mountains, those hills. See, there's a village What's on top of that. And yeah, there's all kinds of archaeological sites. Which I'm not too much into, but I do appreciate it. I mean, even seeing that now, I appreciate it. I, I went to Angkor Wat as well in Cambodia, and it was pretty cool. I mean, you know, I was not blown away by it because I'm not the guy. I like old stuff. But not like that old stuff. It's not. It doesn't. Doesn't you know? Doesn't. Doesn't butter my chicken. You know. If you know what I. You know. What I, know what I mean. I'm much. You know. More interested in, in like you know, towns of 1800 or 1900. You know? But it's beautiful here. Very very much so. And there's a snake here. But that one's dead. It's the first snake I've seen in Egypt, actually. Yeah, so we're straight in the desert. I mean, of course, basically, I mean, you're always in the desert, right? When you're in, in Egypt, in a way. But of course, along the Nile, there's lots of water. And they do know how to fertilize the country. But yeah, see? Outside of this town, or these towns, it's pure desert. And this is like uh, the temple, temple of King Meripod. Here. Oh, come on. Those brakes are not so great. The Marsan Hotel. That'd be cool. This, this actually looks like a very, very cool hotel. I've stayed in places like that, you know. I've, I've, I have uh, crossed the desert before, the Sahara. You know. Traveled all the way through Morocco, Mauritania, until I reached Senegal. It was cool, so we've been in many of these places. Ah, the goat herd. There's some camel. Ooh! That's that. So this is this is a bit strange. 
we arrived there at the at that temple and there was a guy he said ticket I said I have no ticket dude he said oh, no problem I can just pay him my <laughs> garage he said no I don't do corruption and now here I just just came down here from the from the highway La la la. Huh? Check it out. And so I wonder who these guys are. And see, that's the, that's the highway or whatever the, the street, and you just go down here. There's no. There's nothing, you know, that will keep you from it. It's very strange, actually, because these are cool dudes, right? Whoever it is, yeah. You know, if, guys, if you want to learn something about this, you know, there's lots of there's tons of videos that will you know teach you about all of it. And if you come here, you can take a guide. You know, and he will explain the hell out of it. Me? No, no. I just want a little peek. I'm so interested. But it's actually a cool area. You know, the whole area is cool. It's a good thing that you don't have to pay to see the area. Well, basically, you pay because you have to come here. And you have to have a hotel or a, an apartment, you know. And you have to rent a bicycle or a car or a motorcycle. But you know what I mean, right? Pretty cool. I like it. <laughs> See, I'm looking for the right thumbnail. Am I finding it? Not sure. Like, ah! <laughs> Yasin. Yasin. That's a nice name. You live here? You sleeping here? Or far, far? I'm in Ah, okay. I didn't understand that, but that's okay. All right, guy. The, the donkey there and the dogs. The nice, the cool. All right. Bye bye. <laughs> I'm still very surprised by how much free stuff there is, you know. See these columns there, these columns. And you know, this stuff is all free. Is it free or is it just now? Or is it just. If you don't buy a ticket, you don't buy a ticket? I'm not sure. But it is a very cool area, you know. Just. We're just two riders, right? Or well, one rider, and one is a sitter. And. Yeah, we're just, you know, riding through this. And it's cool. And there are not many people here. Salam alaikum. You know? Is this usually full of tourists? Or is it, you know? I think this is all stuff. I could just walk up there. There's nobody here. Nobody will check me. I'll go anywhere for free. <laughs> you know, cool, eh? What do you think? But I don't want to go too far. Because this old thing, it ain't the fittest. And it's going down, down, down. And I have to go back up, up, up. Anyway, hi right, Vincent, let's turn around here. And then we suddenly ride into the desert. It's cool, what is this? Are these like death chambers there, you know? I don't know. Is this there a ticket booth? Or is this a military thing? No idea. This is um, the South Asif Conservation Project. This is the tomb of Karakamaman, the tomb of Karabaskan, the tomb of Iriom. So there's lots of tombs here. I suppose this guy there is the ticket guy. But yeah, sun is going down while leaving anyway. And it's closed anyway, they close it at five. So if you want to come here after, do that before, the, before five o'clock in the evening. <laughs> you know, probably come in the morning, right? It is a very cool place. <laughs> so we were like shooed away here. It's close by some little man, you know, and we, who also thought I'll give him money. I told him, "Fuck it, you should go. You should go crawl back into his tent." Like that guy over there is like the second guy who thinks he's got some power. How are you gonna enforce that, you little nothing? Oh, I'm sorry, that, I, that, really, that really pissed me off, you know. They're all corrupt here, they, and I think I, I should go. Of course, i just taking fix, pictures and, and filming. All right, so we're shooed away by this guy, whom I told he should go to hell. He had a big mouth first, but you know. He's not a cop, he's a nobody. <laughs> nobody. No, it's just, and, you know, these, these guys, and then they, you know, once they realize that, you know, they don't have power over you. They ask you for money so you can be here. So this is actually the coolest time of the day. And they, 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 they try to shoo you away. 
huh? But here it's very nice. I like it. There's another guy eyeing us there from there, and I'm sure it doesn't take long for him to come here, you know, showing us his power, which he doesn't have, of course. But anyway, so it's a little taste of the surroundings, a little taste of the desert, you know. I'm sure it's worth doing the, you know, the Valley of the Kings and the whole thing, you know. But if you come here, have some time, have a few days, just so you can, you know, just, uh, you, you know, have some, some days just to hang out, relax, go look at a few things, rent a bicycle, you know, ride around, you know, look at the, at, at the villages, you know, it's cool, it's nice, you know, and go see that stuff too, it's interesting. Get a guide or a guidebook, you know, uh, not like us, <laughs> we're ignorant pricks. Now, of course, with kids, it's not so much fun, of course. Maybe some kids are interested, but I wouldn't be. But I think kids will like this. Just being in a desert is definitely a cool thing. Hello. Yeah. See, even the cow said hi. Taking off, okay? Hey, Vincent, let's go. He's also taking pictures and starting to film. <laughs> he started vlogging. Hey, little logger. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's it from us. Uh, yeah, I'll see you when I see you. Or you see me when you see me, you know. Bye-bye. And take good care. Bye.